The Avraham Avinu Synagogue is a wonderful example for what happened to the Jewish property here under the Jordanian occupation. This place was ruined. It was used as a ships and donkeys pen. And when we came here, we began to struggle and to dig and to find a place. And as you see today, thank God, Baruch Hashem, it's renovated and the synagogue again is active. It's a wonderful place. What happened to the Jewish property here in Hebron, when the Arabs came in, when they took over, they destroyed everything. And the same as the Ezra house. The Ezra house was abandoned. It was used for a couple of years as a, as a store, and then it was abandoned. And thank God Jewish families came in and renovated the place, and today it's a wonderful house. I wonder how organizations that claim to, to, uh, for, for justice, they think only for the Arab justice, and they ignore the Jewish justice. The Jewish people was here hundreds of years. The Ezra house is a Jewish property for 500 years. But, but those organizations that are paid a lot, a lot of budgets from the European Union and other hostile organizations, they ignore the justice and they claim for the rights of Arab invaders who took over this property, this property after the massacre in the, Jewish, in the Jewish community here in 1929. And we demand the justice. And I believe, thank, Be'ezrat Hashem, we are going to make it, and justice will come back to Hebron, and Jewish property will return back, Be'ezrat Hashem, to hands of Jewish families. Supposedly some organizations don't like to see a house with Jewish families, with children, a beautiful house. They want to see ruins. They want to destroy. All what they want is destruction. All the, what they want is hate. And this is what, what they want to achieve. Bet Ezra is a wonderful big house in Hebron. It's Jewish property. It was built by the government of Israel. People live here more than 10 years. And now only the stores in this, in this level that were abandoned by the Arabs later on were used as a uh, as place of, uh, of living by the Jewish families who live here. And you can see today it's a wonderful neighborhood of the Jewish uh, uh, community in Hebron. And the Ezra house, which is now under discussion, is the stores in this level. And uh, the only uh, re rational solution is to allow the families renovate this place and stay and live here.